Welcome to WatchGuard's Daily Security Byte. I'm Corey Nockreiner. Today's story is drone spying on hard drives. My favorite futuristic hacking a university, Ben Gurion University from Israel, is up to it again. If you've seen my other videos in the past, the researchers at Ben Gurion University are very good at finding novel ways to spy using computers and malware. They often focus on what you call covert channel attacks, where they find different ways to transfer transmit data from a computer to other digital devices even when they're air-gapped, when they're not networked technically together. Anyways, their latest attack is quite interesting. Basically, they found a way to make the, the blinky light on your hard drive transmit data. And compared to some of their other covert channels, like uh, audio waves and things like that, they say this particular channel is pretty fast at transmitting data. The hard drive light can actually blink so quickly that you can't see it. According to them, you can actually send 4,000 bytes per second using using that little blinky light on the hard drive. Which, by the way, is still not a ton of data, but it's enough to send things like passwords or, or digital certificates and keys and things like that. Anyways, in a very interesting video, which you're watching in the background here, they actually show that an attacker might actually use a drone to pull up to an office window that has a view of somebody's hard drive, and by watching that blinking light, they can actually recover data from that computer from the drone's camera. Now, the major caveat here is hard drives aren't naturally going to blink your password out to people. In order for this attack to work, the bad guy has to already have hijacked the computer. They have to have malware on that particular computer to get the hard drive to blink the way they want to. And the whole point of this hack is to actually get data out of an air gap computer, a computer that's not on the internet. So, by definition, that would make it a lot harder to get malware on the computer in the first place. So this really isn't a super practical attack. I don't expect any uh, uh, cyber criminals to really start using this, but it really is quite interesting research, and it's certainly in the realm of nation-state hacking, something they might use. And in any case, as a drone fan, I just think it's interesting that you use a drone to spy on a hard drive. Anyways, interesting research, and there's a great white paper Ben Gurion researchers released on this. Be sure to check it out if you're interested. That's it for today's story. Thank you for watching.